Good morning and welcome to Utopia on this rainy day. Uh, let's go inside and see what today has to bring for us. Creep dolls. Creep pen's pretty well full. They got one guy out here, but he's heading that way at a leisurely play pace. But uh, looks like everybody's in here today. Go join him, buddy. <coughs> Summer eating the creep feed, but still the hay is uh, the number one choice. Some of the bigger ones are eating the creep. Such a nice girl. Oh, yeah. Where's that big glammy of yours, eh? He's a big boy, isn't he? Yeah, yeah he is. Here he comes. He heard you. He heard you. He's coming. He's right there. There he is. Here he comes. Here he comes. She's calling him in. See that? Yeah, it's a good girl, Angel. Angel just called her lamb in. Angel just called her lamb in. Yeah, it's Angel's lamb. I got to see who 15 is because I like this 15. Yeah, I like the 15. They're actually, would not be a very big guy. These guys are slower growers, you gotta give them a chance. For sure. There's a lot of good lambs in here. Hi honey, you looking for some food? But you gotta shake the hay up every day and, uh, and give them creep. There's that lamb that wants to be a friend. 51. Yeah, he comes up every day. Right. I know, but I don't know who he is, but he's extremely <laughs> friendly. Well, that's Angel. Finally paying your bill back, eh? You get that. Why does she have a debt, Ernie? She's for two days, years doing nothing. What? What? A year doing nothing, whatever. She's a lamb. There's Jezebel. Hi, honey. How are you? Hi, Jezzy. How you doing? Hi, you're very pretty. She's got, she's got short ears. Well, she's from Elsie. Elsie's an ICU. Oh. And now these guys are all in it. Yeah, I told you they're eating an uh, easy half tail of grain today. Now, who's going to have to feed them twice a day of grain? 
At that point, I want them to the front. I want the matrix to the front. This this ewe lamb's really nice. The one that was just tried to nurse off her. Wooly face though. No, they're all eating now. That's Jerry in there. And we all know who that is. That's Wally. And this lamb, I don't know who he is. Hi. He's a little runty thing. Oh, hello. Shall I take that off? There you go. He's a little runty thing. And he always comes up for pets. And he's not a bottle baby. But there's always a few sheep in the pen that want to be your friend. And this is one of them. Every time you look down, there he is. Hi, honey. Nah. Hi. Oh, yeah, you're really nice. Who are you? And look at you. Look at you. Are you going to be like your mom? Are you going to be like your mom? Because Angel's very friendly. And this is Angel's son who came up. Are you going to take after your mommy? Yes. Not as friendly as you. Hi, how come you're so nice? How come you're so nice? You're a really nice lad. Too. Then we have a mom nursing and drinking. Her two. You're very pretty. These are the replacement door sets. Oh, I got a video and a message from the guy who bought the ones in Nova Scotia. It took almost a week for them to get there because they did hit an ice storm. And uh, so they were on the road an awfully long time. But he showed me a picture of them in their barn. He has a brand new barn um, set up kind of like these ones. And uh, the ewes were all eating and looking really good so I'm, I'm guessing he's happy with them so that, that turned out well you always worry sending a sheep on a long journey like that and here's all the little guys that we brought over the last two days hi mom what are you doing why are you looking back there Heather where's your lambie So, and if you remember, in this pen we had left a dorset ewe in here because she couldn't stand up and walk when we moved the others over. She had a little bit of listeriosis. So we treated her and that's her right there, standing all on her own. She's waiting for the feed to come in. She seems uh, all good to go now. But we'll probably keep her in this group for a little longer just because it's uh, a smaller group and she doesn't have to fight for the feet as much. But once she gets, uh, we're fully confident that she's back to her normal self, we'll uh, walk her over to her own group. So we're feeding these guys. This barn's getting third cut hay. Third cut alfalfa grasses mix. Because these girls are milking, the replacements are growing, so uh, these guys are getting good hay. We try to save the third cut for this time of year and feed the poorer hay up in the beginning. But 
we, right now we want these girls milking well. And again, there we have not, nothing in the creep area yet because um, these lambs are just a little young for eating creep feed. But it doesn't matter. They still are in there exploring, um, taking a little break from them and, and enjoying the freedom. Hi, guys. Yeah, you guys look happy. We actually have a tiny little sample portion for these guys in here so that they can explore and nibble at it. Step up on their little bench. Hi. Pretty soon these boys will be being sold for breeding stock. They're getting close to that age now. Hard to believe. Well, these are going to be breeding stock rams, so you want them in good shape. Well, it was basically a quiet day on the farm today, so we uh, went and did groceries and got caught up in some stuff like that. And I guess uh, we're going to call it a day, and uh, we'll talk to you again tomorrow. I think uh, tomorrow we got a few more action-packed events happening, so uh, we'll see how that goes. We still got the tree up. Isn't that sad? Anyway... Bye for now.